Yesterday, you guys were doing some uh, lower body. So today is a cardio blast and upper body workout. It's going to be good. Go into some little heel toe rocks, starting at the bottom, working our way up. Core is engaged. We are going to start the day right with each other. So if it's six o'clock for you, or if it's nine o'clock and you're jumping on and you want to tell us where you're from, I'll get back to that chat box later. We could give you a little shout out. So I'll explain what we're doing in just a sec. But we're going to warm up. My video is going to be pinned. Julia is recording just me, so don't worry. You should be focused right on my picture. Take one leg, do some little crossovers. I got my fancy pants on for you. And Christine called me out on my big cup of coffee, my large cup. Don't worry, it was only one. I'll have the second one after this. After we get in that sweat, switch legs, good. Opening up those hips. So today's workout, it's gonna be good. It's kind of like a pyramid, but different. What we do is we're gonna start with cardio exercises. Take it into a little squat into your calf raise. So we will go only 30 seconds per exercise today with 10 seconds in between. We have straight cardio exercises. Most of them are cardio. You're gonna incorporate a little upper body and strength too. But the goal is to kind of blast your heart rate up with the first full set, okay? So it's about four minutes through but only 30 seconds per exercise. Hold it down, tap side to side. Then how the pyramid works. As you get through those exercises, every time we go back to the top to repeat, you're replacing one exercise with an upper body exercise. Don't worry, it's not totally, there's planks, there's all sorts of core work kind of mixed in, including the upper body, but it's always gonna include the upper body. Take that into a lateral lunge with a raise, opening up the chest and shoulders, core is engaged. So here's the fun part. We replace the top exercise, go back through more cardio. Then you replace two exercises from the top, repeat the other exercises, the other five. Then you'll replace three, does that make sense? If it doesn't, don't worry. I have a whiteboard right to the side of me that's gonna tell us exactly what to do. All I need you to think about is working hard for those 30 seconds. When you're on, you'll get 10 seconds to breathe and grab water and to watch me and to get started right away with whatever's next. Give me some lunges back with a rotation. Rotating over that front leg nice and slow. Working out the spine. It's gonna be good, guys. It's gonna be good. And, uh, Leslie made the special request for her this morning, so hopefully she's on. Because I invited. We're doing it. Then at the very end, if we have an extra couple minutes, this is going to take us right into the 30-ish minute zone. I timed it out. So at the end, we should have a couple minutes for core, a little extra core, I should say. And then we'll do a beautiful meditation to set you off your day. My pregnant, newly postpartum mamas, or if you just got a little tight back today or anything funky going on, don't worry. I will provide options for everybody. Reaches overhead. Everybody's getting out of their sweat on today. Honor your body, but remember, if you can push it hard and work hard for those 30 seconds, bring that intensity up. You want to make every minute in this workout count. We are here for 30-ish minutes together. So we're gonna make every second matter. Bring it across your body. We gotta get this party started right away this morning. Now the first round is we kind of add exercises on. If I need a little extra few seconds, give me grace. But I want you to get started when you know what you're doing. Just get that party started right away. Get started right away. You know your option. You know you want the more intense version, you do it. All right, let's take it into modified jacks. 
or regular then I want you while you're still hopping to give me a thumbs up if you are ready for this and you're like I may not know what to expect but I'm doing it you ready you ready Dulcinea is ready it's gonna be fun it's gonna be good Amanda it's gonna be good Holly it's gonna be good Megan's got those arms going okay back to your jacks now take those feet into a little ski reach those arms this is all just extra remember these first I had to cut it down I was getting a little aggressive this morning so we've got seven total is in this nice little circuit okay keep breathing keep moving reach those arms 30 seconds on then 10 seconds to switch exercises I'm getting our timer ready most of them are pretty simple so we can move nice and quick this morning and continuous movement almost there morning Courtney five Leslie this one's for you I see you woo four three we're gonna take it into high knees high knees so you're here or nice and fast let's go mamas and I saw some dads in there you too get that family workout on 30 seconds then you have 10 seconds to either get started or to take a little break I will show you what's next right away High knees, hands can be up, you could be here. Whatever work version gets that heart rate up. We're gonna go little mummy taps, heel taps, cross the arms. Now, how do you make it harder? Go nice and fast. Keep those arms long and strong. 30 seconds starts now. Good. So you could be here taking out the high impact jump. You can make your arms a little bigger. They're crossing top to bottom. But guys, they're not loose. They're strong. They're engaged. Those shoulders are working. 10 more seconds. You get a teeny break with some sumo squats and side crunches. Those are coming next, so let's work it. Three, two, one. Hands up. Squat, side crunch. Squat, side crunch. Notice my toes are out. My knees are out. I have a nice wide sumo squat. I'm taking my knees wide. Let's go. Down. Yeah. Elbow to hip. Breathing. What is this? This is core work, right? You're throwing it in. Mixed in with those cardio blasts. Good. 10 seconds. We're going right into power jacks. Catch your breath. Good. Three, two, one. So you're either here or steps out, steps in. Nice fast feet. Ready, set, go. 30 seconds. Powerful, strong. That body's awake. We might have just gotten started, but you're ready. Let's go. Core strong. Strong body, strong mind. Remember that. You can do anything. You've got 12 seconds. Cardio blast this first circuit for five, four, three, two. Let's go into skaters. Skaters right here. Reach across your body. How do you make this more intense? Touch the ground. All the way down. Or you're doing wider hops, right? Keep the chest open. Shoulders back. That core is really working, especially with those reaches. You want to be more athletic? Throw it down. Grab, throw, grab, throw. <sighs> 10 seconds. Oh, you're awake now. We got plank jacks next. My newly postpartum mamas, pregnant mamas, you can hold a plank for the 30 seconds. You could even do push ups against the wall. You could be here. Everybody else? Plank jacks. Out and in. Plank jacks. You're in a plank. You can even tap it out. If you just want to take out the jump, tap it out. You're really going to feel those obliques. Out and in or taps. Now, do me a favor. Drop your hips down just a little bit. Ooh, I see those booties dropping. Perfect. That's it. Beautiful, beautiful outside. Dulcinea, Leslie, I love it. Three, 
two, one. Last one in this circuit. Stand up here. Give me your nice, simple jump squats or squat calf raise. Nice and fast. Remember, as we go back to repeat, every exercise one at a time is going to be replaced. Starting with our first exercise. So this is your last one. Just breathe. 10 seconds. Then we're back to the top. In five, four, three, two, one. Grab your band. Catch your breath with bicep curls. So this one, we're replacing the high knees. You can say goodbye to those. Squeeze your biceps. Elbows are pinned by your side. Slowly release down. Curl up, slow release. <sighs> Breathing. Now, you could do one arm at a time. Maybe your bands feel real tight this morning. I want you to hold it halfway. Little inch movements, up and down. Up and down, right where it burns for five, four, three, two, one. Back to your toe taps and arm crosses. Everything else is gonna stay the same. Let's go. Toe taps. We gotta get back down to the bottom. Then we'll add on another one. Keep going, keep going. Cross those arms, tap those heels, or just kick and tap. Sometimes, that modified version works better for your body, meaning it can get your heart rate up. Your body gets it more. Eight seconds, seven, big crosses, strong arms, four, three, two, one. Toes out, knees out, squat, crunch. Let's go. Remember, every sweat matters. If you are tagging, Fit for Mom San Diego, you are entered in to win some swag every single week. Those winners are announced in our emails. <sighs> Down and up. <sighs> Give me that nice, strong crunch, elbow to hip. Try to keep those arms up. Standing core work. Get low, feeling those inner thighs. Drop it down as much as you can. Four, finish it out. Three, two, one, power jacks, down, it's only 30 seconds. You wanna go, you go. Remember, you could be here. Again, let's keep going with those inner thighs. Toes out, knees out. Knees never going past those toes. You're powerful, you have a powerful jump, but you're always focusing on that form. A little pause in that squat. 10 seconds, good, eight, seven, yes, I like the pull down, four, three, two, one. Skaters, remember, you wanna reach and throw, get that aggression out, mama. You like the reaches across, this is your workout, 30 seconds has started. I must have turned my buzzer down today, it's only beeping at me, normally, a super aggressive buzzer that you guys can all hear. 15 seconds, don't worry, I'm keeping us on point. Get low. Do you need to touch the ground to get those glutes on fire? Again, another core exercise. Three, two, one. We're dropping it down to the floor. You're in that plank. Let's try this for everyone. One tap out or jumps. Both feet. Plank jacks, only 30 seconds. Out and in. Form is always important. Make sure you're dropped down. Beautiful. You need to go slower, you're gonna feel those obliques, I promise you, with those tap outs. Even if you're on one knee. 10 seconds. Keep moving that body, no matter what that means. Four, three, two, you can do it. Stand up, shake it out. Last one, then we add on. You got your jump squats or squat up to those toes. Let's go. Now this is gonna be the blast that your body needs, right? 
the cardio you need because we're going to go back to biceps and then I'm going to throw on another upper body one. What's your focus today? Cardio and upper body. That's right. But of course, we got to add in some combo with the core. Three, two, one. Grab your band, bicep curls. Get those started if you're ready. You got weights, use weights. You got nothing, grab a water bottle. You don't have no water bottle, you just squeeze. Make your fists your weights. Grab a kid, curl the kid, right? You do bicep curls with your kid. They actually think it's really fun. And they're heavy. 15 seconds. We're gonna do that extra burn right at the end. Hold it halfway for me. Hold it right here, up and down. Five, four, let's go. Three, elbows pin. Two, one. Guess what? Hinge, kick it back. So your elbows are glued to your side. You're gonna kick and extend. Pull it back in. Notice, I am not moving from the elbow up. Elbow down, does all the extension. Get nice and low. There's a wall on each side of you, right? So you can't take those arms too wide. Don't let those elbows drop. Keep them right behind that back, right at that waistline. All right, let's hold it, straight arms. Reach for the ceiling. Straight arms, fast. Three, two, one. Back to your power jacks. We're gonna keep adding on, guys. You look beautiful. Power jacks, ready? Here, here. Powerful or out. Nice, fast feet. Point those toes out, knees out in that direction. That's it, you're already only at 20 seconds. Guys, this is a burner. I hope you're sweating like me. I wanted to mix it up for you this morning. Give us something fresh. Just like you're in the studio, but better. You didn't have to travel. You didn't have to commute. All right, right into those skaters. Now remember, this is your chance. If you need a quick swig of water, grab it. If you want a little extra bonus, go for it. 30 seconds has just started. Good. Reach pull, right? Maybe that feels better. Keep your core engaged as you shift your weight. Everything inside your midsection is working. Strong back, strong core. Strong back is so important for us, especially with heavy kiddos, right? Plank jacks, plank jacks, down on the ground, come up, or taps. In three, two, one, out and in. Try to keep those hips low. Nice control. Engage the core like you're sucking the belly button into the spine. <sighs> Breathe. Remember that internal girdle? That little corset in there? Those deep transverse abdominals? They're in there. Only way to get them is that breath. Three, two, one. One more, right here. And then we're back to the top. Add it on the third exercise. Here we go, or I should say, replacing. So you could be here. You need to catch your breath. Be here with me, meet me here. Down and up, squeezing the glutes. Little extra squeeze at the top. But remember, we've got some upper body coming up. So you get a little break after this. In five, four, three, two, one. Grab your band. Biceps, we're back to the top. You got this, we're back to the top, let's go. Biceps, here we go. Here we go, here we go, squeeze, squeeze. Chest and shoulders are open. Your elbows are glued right by your waistline. You could alternate, right? We're gonna do our little inch movements coming up. Halfway up, hold it right where it burns. Go up and down from there. Three, 
two, one. Tricep kickbacks, out, in, push, pull. If you're ready, let's get started. Now, relax your shoulders, right? They're not squeezing your neck. Your neck is nice and long. Your chest is open. Kick it out and in, out and in. Try to feel the back of those arms as you kick out. Squeeze, squeeze. Let's hold those arms straight and give me those press backs for five, four, let it burn, three, two, one. Good, we're gonna go into a squat with the shoulder press. Squat, press up. If that's too much with the band, squat, one arm. Squat, other arm. Only 25 seconds. Maybe you have weights. Same exact thing. Sit, reach. Sit, reach. Breathe. 10 seconds. Good. I'm actually adding on an extra one this round because I want you to make sure to get them all in. We're gonna be in a plank. We're replacing one more exercise. Now you're gonna walk to the side, walk back, walk to the side, walk back, or hop, center, side, center. Taking those knees to the corner and back to the plank. Side, plank, side, plank, or walking the feet. Same thing. You could walk and feel the same exact thing. Five, four, three, two, one. Shake it out. All right. Skaters, right here. Let's go. Just a couple more, and then we're back to the top. That's how it's rolling today. It's like a Jenny pyramid. <laughs> Keep going. Side reaches. And none of the three girls are awake yet. So don't jinx it. We got this. Eight seconds. Last five. Four. Three. Two. One. We're down for those plank jacks. That upper body is working for the next remainder of class. Taps, right? Or you could tap on one knee or jumps. 25 seconds. Keep those hips low, core strong. Your core is your power center. <sighs> Treat it right. Make sure you're breathing. <sighs> 10 seconds. Stay with me, let's go. Last five, four, three, two, one. Up, 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 up. All right, last one in the circuit. Your beautiful squat jumps. I saved the best for last. Remember, you can do those calf raises. Nice, controlled, quick squats. Or maybe you're not going quite as low, but you're powering, adding that nice little leap off of the ground. 10 seconds. Let me see you. Then we're back to the top in five, four, Three, yes, two, one. Grab your band or your weights. Back from the top. Guys, I'm dripping. Got me dripping. Here we go. Biceps, chest and shoulders open. Squeeze. We're on point. So we're adding on one, two, three, four. We're adding on the fifth one. Woo, we are almost there. Keep squeezing. All right, let's do that burn one more time. Halfway up, up and down, right where you feel it. Three, two, one, hinge at the hips. Take it back, glue those elbows by your side, pull the band or weights up. Ready? Take backs. Targeting those triceps. Breathe. 
Then you're into your squat and shoulder presses. Those will be coming. We gotta let these triceps burn a little bit though. Right? Let's hold it back, straight arms. Inch movement, like you're gonna touch the ceiling with your wrists. Five, four, straight arms. Three, two, one. Squat, shoulder press. Take those feet hip width apart. Take the band right up to the shoulders, elbows are lifted. Sit into the heels, tall body. I'm not 5'2 today. I'm gonna touch the ceiling today. Getting your endorphins pumping to last you your entire hump day. You've got patience, you've got gratitude, you've got your mind right, you're setting your intentions. And it all starts right here. Three, two, one. All right, we're gonna go down to those planks. If those bother you, or you're just starting to feel tired, drop to the knees. You're hopping side to side or stepping, right? Side to side. What is this targeting? The obliques. You need a little bit more intensity this morning? Give me those hops. Controlled hops, knees coming towards the core, right? A nice little side crunch. And you don't have to go super fast. Better to have control than speed on this one. Stand up. Put these one around each foot. Slip it down so the handle's on the arch. Give me some upright rows. Elbows wide. So my band, one on each foot, I'm stepping on it. You want to add a plie, you can. You just want to do the upper body, elbows wide, wrists are neutral. Show me those beautiful shoulders. Yes, that plie is extra, yep. You got it. Nice, strong upper body. Three, two, one, slip it off the feet. Oh, we just replaced skaters. So guess what? Now you get to hit the floor for plank jacks. Here we go. Out and in, four steps. This one, you want that heart rate to get up a little bit. Right here, work. 20 seconds. 20 seconds. Let's go, and then we have one more full round. Here we are, last 10, nine, eight, Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Stand up. Last one. You've got your beautiful jump squats. You want to mix it up? You could hop forward and hop back. 30 seconds. You need a little movement in your life this morning? Let's move it. Forward and back. Or up to those toes. Knees right behind the toes, focusing on form no matter where you're at. 10 seconds. Push, push, push. Get that body burning. Five, four, three, two, one. All right, we're going through everything. One more time. You've got four minutes of work. You in? You in? All right, let's do this. Biceps. I saw you raising that arm, Dulcinea. She's in. Squeeze, squeeze, I think that was you. Yes, that was. All right, 20 seconds. Is this good, guys? I know you can't tell me because you're holding weights or a band. I hope it's good. Halfway, let's go up and down. Three, two, triceps now. Shake those arms out. We got to go front to back, right? Elbows tight. Hinge at the hips. Let's go. Out. In. Nice controlled movement. You can look at yourself and your screen. You probably don't have a mirror in front of you. Let me be your mirror. Match me. We're in this together. I'm right next to you. Ten seconds. Let's hold it, straight arms. Let it burn for me. Don't give up on yourself. Three, two, one.
squat press, and then we're down for those side to side plank hops. Arms up, elbows up, sit, reach tall. Down and up. Sitting back into those heels. Powerful, strong. You can do anything for 10 more seconds. That's all you got. Each time you get through an exercise, it's the last time you're doing it. Give me just little inch movements up. Three, two, one. All right, down. Plank, side to side hops or steps. Let's go. So steps. You can even cross that ankle if you notice. I'm tapping my ankle with one foot. That works, or side, plank, side, plank. Control, protecting the back. 10 seconds, that's all you got. Keep it up. Five, four, three, two, one. Slowly stand up, try not to get dizzy. Put the band over the feet. A little bit more shoulder work, but for those anterior delts, right? Those shoulder muscles you see in those tank tops. Let me see those strong arms. Good. You could just do those upright rows or add that plie. Toes out, knees out. Almost there. 10 seconds. Can you hold those arms up for me? Can you reach it right where it hurts? Four, three, two, one. I like to say delicious discomfort. Guess what? Two more exercises. Push ups side to side. So you're going to go center, walk it, side, walk it, center, walk it, side, center, side. Now you could be on your toes too, right? 20 seconds left. So you're walking to the middle, push up. Walk those hands off your mat, push up, walk center, push up, walk it over, push up, five seconds, four, three, two, one. Pregnant mamas, you probably want to stay right here. You want to go up and down though? Take your stance wide, inchworm. Walk it out, bonus, another push up. You could do it, it was only 30 seconds before, and this is your last bit of work. Walk it back and forth, throwing in that push-up if you would like. Keep going, keep going. You're almost there. 10 seconds, good morning, Dominica. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, stay on the ground in a tabletop. You finished your circuit. You can take that, baby. All right, I want you to show me. I want you to flex for me real quick. Then we're going to stretch it out and do one more core exercise because it's hump day. You know that? It's hump day. Show Fit for Mom what you're made of. Yes, Jenny's totally going to share this. And so will they. Beautiful. Okay, now back to your tabletop position. My phone will be held hostage now. Back to your tabletop. Here we go. Okay, we're not done yet. I want you to do a little opposite arm and leg reach, but I want you to give me a lateral extension. So reach, opposite arm and leg, go out to the side, center, down, switch arms. Extend opposite arm and leg, reach out to the side, center, and down. You'll feel those glutes. You're gonna feel those obliques stretching. We're getting those nice toned muscles. <sighs> Leaning them out. Beautiful. Good. Hold it in a tabletop. I want you to snake that head around. So look towards your hip. Look to the center. Look towards the other hip. Back to the center. A little cat and cow breathing. Drop the belly. Inhale up. Exhale round. Drop the belly. Inhale up. Go get your muffins. Exhale round. Drop the belly, inhale, exhale. One more, 
deep cleansing, energizing breaths. You feel amazing. Good. Curl those toes under if you would like. You could stay in that tabletop. You're gonna press back to downward dog. We're gonna pedal those feet. You could stay right here pedaling. I want you to shake your head. Yes, I did it. No, no more. Take one leg, extend it up to the ceiling if you would like, or you could stay in the pedal. Take the heel to glute, opening up the hip and the quad. Take it back up, other side. Then we're gonna go right into your meditation. The most perfect way to set your intentions for the day. Down, slowly walk it back, nice wide stance. Round and ragdoll it up, vertebrae by vertebrae. Big deep cleansing breaths up. Inhale, exhale one more time. Then I'm gonna have you find that nice, comfortable position. You could be seated right on your mat with your palms up. You could be lying down. Give your body what it needs this morning. You could dim your lights. Thanks, Holly. Here we go. Just like a moment of self-care, a moment to just be present and be you. You love the switch up. So it says Patrick, but I'm guessing that might be your husband's account. Good morning, Erica. Good to see you again. Love seeing the familiar faces. All right, big deep cleansing breaths, guys. Any last little stretches your body needs, feel free to do it now. While you're seated or lying down, first just close your eyes. And if you're still stretching it out, you could still be with me, taking it in, allowing that body to release a little bit deeper into your mat. You could take one hand, place it over the chest, one hand over the belly, so the heart and the belly connecting with your breath, allowing yourself the gift of being present, connecting with your body, regrounding, recentering, feeling the warmth and the energy run through you. Start to deepen your breath and allow all the thoughts or the chaos around you, just let it go, let it be. Inhaling in for four, three, two, one, hold, four, three, two, one, release, four, three, two, one. Again, inhale, four, three, two, one, hold, four, three, two, one, release, four, three, two, one. As you sit or lie there, feel your body with each deep cleansing breath sink deeper and deeper into the mat, connecting with the earth. <sighs> Feeling the light like a light bath come over you from head down to your chest, surrounding your heart center, allowing your cup to refill, knowing that showing up here with your community, with your village, allows you to reconnect with yourself, with your purpose, giving yourself the best gift of self-care. As you breathe deeply and give yourself a positive word of affirmation, some self-love, reminding yourself how beautiful you are, how strong you are, how resilient you are, that you are enough, you are appreciated, just in case you needed that reminder today. Now take a moment to send gratitude, maybe a silent prayer, energy to those out there that are in need, those that are struggling, those that can't work out. Maybe those on the front line that left their house last night and still are not home or left at four this morning, send a silent prayer of healing and strength to them. Bring it back to your heart, to yourself, giving yourself a moment to just breathe deeply and release. Grateful for this healthy body just as it is. Grateful for my journey 
grateful for who I am today and who I'm becoming. Slowly start to call yourself back, wiggling your fingers and your toes. You could roll to your side in a fetal position or stay lying down, whatever you prefer. We're gonna take our arms and with a final few big breaths together, inhaling up, exhale, hands to heart center. One more big, deep, awakening, energizing breath. Feel the love and positivity surrounding you. Exhale, remember, may the light in me shine and honor in each of you. The final most important stretch is always your beautiful smiles. Thank you guys for being here and for letting me mix it up. Hopefully you enjoyed your cardio blast and upper body. You still got everything. You still did our HIIT training, just in a little different variation. Thank you, Marcy. Thank you, Erica. Thank you. Thanks, Thanks Kayla. That was awesome. It was Yay. nice. To you liked it? Yeah, I did. Good. That was great, Jenny. Thank you. Have a great Thank day. You. Bye, Dulcinea. Bye, Courtney. Thanks, Tiani and Brooke. That was awesome. Thank you. Yay. Thanks, Julia.